Hello and welcome to this Concord Help Center video. In this video, we will be talking about new updates to Concord that were introduced in the latest Concord release. There are a number of improvements in this release, and most of them are improvements to Concord's search functionality. We've improved your ability to search for hyphenated words. In this release video, I will demonstrate these new improvements to search. First, we'll look at when you're searching for a word that you don't realize is hyphenated, Concord will use the did you mean function, which allows you to update your search to include that hyphenated word. After that, I'll talk about hyphenated words and wildcard search and how that's been improved. Then, I'll talk about Bible names and hyphenated words that now can be looked up with more modern spelling. So, let's get right into the first example, and we're going to go to the search bar in the Study Tools panel. I'm going to click in the search bar, and I'm going to look up the word potato patch. This was a common word that people wrote in about saying they can't find the results for this word. They know it's in Mrs. Eddy's writings, but they couldn't find it. So I'll type that in, potato patch. And you see when I click the magnifying glass search button, there are no book results found. What we did when there are two words that are actually hyphenated, we, we added this did you mean and then the word, and you can actually click on the word here, potato patch with a hyphen, and it will update your search. So when I click on this, you'll see my search bar will change to include the results for potato hyphen patch. And you can now find where Mrs. Eddy references this word. And so this is just a subtle improvement to help you more easily find what you're looking for. Next, let's look at hyphenated words and wildcard search. So I'll go back up to the search bar and I'll click the X to clear my search. Next, I want to show you hyphenated words and wildcard search and how that's been improved. Prior to this release, if you tried to use the wildcard search with a hyphen, it wasn't able to bring you very focused and refined results. Now, when you type in a prefix like all hyphen, and then put an asterisk at the very end, when you click the magnifying glass search icon, this will launch the search and you'll get all the different hyphenated endings. So we'll get all loving, all absorbing, all power, etc. And you'll see when I click the search magnifying glass, all of my results include all in all, all loving, all power, all wise, all absorbing. There's so many different endings that I can now see. And we're really excited to share this improvement with you all because we think it will be very helpful and it will take your hyphenated searching to the next level. There are some words which were commonly hyphenated in the past which are not hyphenated in most of today's dictionaries. To ensure that these search results aren't missed, Concord has been programmed to return these hyphenated words even if you don't add the hyphen in. For example, today and Bethlehem are words which are hyphenated in the Bible. And if you type today without the hyphen in the search bar, Concord will show you where today and to hyphen day appear in the books. I'll demonstrate this. I'll go back to the search bar and I'll type in today and then click search. And when I open the search results from the Bible, you can see the results for to hyphen day, and then when I go to, for example, the hymnal, you can see the more common version of the spelling of today. We hope this improvement makes it just a little bit easier to find the search results you're looking for. In addition to these improvements, we've also released a number of bug fixes in this recent release. You might not have noticed them, but please know that we're continuing to improve the program. If you'd like to see a written list 
with all the changes, updates, and bug fixes included in this release, go to the description of this video and then click on our change log and you'll be able to see those changes. This is a new video for us and if you liked this release video, please let us know. Email us at concord at cspscom and we'd be happy to hear your feedback as well as answer any questions. We hope you have fun exploring this new release and happy studying.